10 Outrageous Forest Fires We all cannot forget the heart-wrenching video of a thirsty koala desperately stopping a cyclist to take a drink amid the heat wave caused by the bushfire in Australia. That and many other such images of burnt koalas destruction showed us the devastation caused by such forest fires. Throughout history, our planet has suffered countless disasters, from devastating earthquakes to horrifying hurricanes. The Earth has endured it all. In this video, we're focusing on the fiercest fires of our history. While there have been many blazing bee moths that have scorched cities, forests and empires, but we will focus on the top 10 forest fires that took the most lives and caused the most destruction. Number 10. The Black Saturday Bushfires February 7, 2009 Australia has fallen victim to many bushfires over the years, but the Black Saturday bushfires are by far the worst. The Black Saturday bushfires were a series of fires that burned across the Australian state of Victoria. They were the deadliest in the country's history. Over 400 individual fires burned in the state of Victoria from February to March 2009 consuming over 1 million acres and out of the ordinary heat wave record setting temperatures. And high winds contributed to the start of the spread of these bushfires downed power lines. Arson and lightning are just some of the many catalysts of the raging inferno in all 173 direct identified fatalities were recorded this figure was later increased to 180 fatalities. After several people succumbed to their injuries, as many as 400 individual fires were recorded that Saturday following the events of that horrifying day and its aftermath. That day has become widely referred to in Australia as Black Saturday. Number 9. The Great Hinckley's Fire The pine forests and surrounding areas of Hinckley, Minnesota were in the midst of a two-month-long drought in the summer of 1894. Several small fires ignited in Pine County, and since the ground was covered with branches and harvested trees, the flames spread rapidly. The town of Hinckley and several surrounding settlements were made up over 250,000 acres were completely destroyed. Although the official death count was 418, the actual number of fatalities was likely higher due to the intensity of the blaze. Thomas Boston Corbett, the Union soldier who killed President Abraham Lincoln's assassin John Wilkes Booth, is thought to have died in the blaze, which remains one of the deadliest fires in Minnesota history. Number 8. Siberian Taiga Fires The biggest wildfire by far takes us into the country of Russia in the year 2003. The Siberian Taiga Fires spanned over 47 million acres, primarily boreal forest were burned in southern Siberia from 14th of March to 8th of August. Direct carbon emissions were around 400 to 640 TGC. When you take a look at the satellite images, you can see that Eurasia is covered in smoke. Smoke plumes from the fires had covered the skies of Osaka, Japan, which was approximately 3,000 miles away, as well as soot from the fires were reported to reach as far as Seattle, Washington. Although we can't pinpoint the exact source of the fires, these fires were set accidentally or intentionally, we don't know, but illegal timber firms are known to sell cheap lumber in China, might be one of the triggers. Number 7. The 2007 California Wildfires The 2007 California wildfire season was one of the worst in state history. At its peak, over 9,000 separate fires burned and they were so big they could be seen from space. Approximately 1 million acres of land from Santa Barbara County down to the U.S.-Mexico border was destroyed. 14 people died, 9 directly due to the flames, countless others were injured and forced to evacuate their homes. One fire started when a semi-truck overturned. A 10-year-old boy admitted that he accidentally started the buckwheat fire by playing with matches. Causes of the remaining fires remain under investigation. In October, Governor Arnold Schwarzenegger declared a state of emergency in seven counties, while President George W. Bush called for federal aid to assist state and local efforts. When it was over, more than a million people were displaced. The October 2007 wildfires collectively caused over $2 billion in property damages. Number 6. The Great Chicago Fire On the night of October 1871, a small fire ignited in a barn on D. Coven Street. 
two days and over $220 million in damage, later roughly 3.3 square miles of the windy city was destroyed. An estimated 300 people were dead despite a swift response by the Chicago Fire Department. The firefighters ended up in an incorrect location because of the watchman's mistake, and so the inferno grew unchecked. Drought conditions and the use of wood as the prominent building material aided the spread of the flames. While nobody knows for sure how exactly the fire started, the Chicago Fire Academy, which now sits on D. Coven Street, makes sure it doesn't happen again. Number 5. The Peshtigo The Peshtigo Fire, often overshadowed by Great Chicago Fire, which took place on the same day, fire began in the forest, where it was common practice amongst Midwestern heirs to start small fires in order to clear trees for farming and railroads. However, on October 8, 1871, strong winds moving in from the west fueled the flames and caused them to spread to the town of Festigo, turning the innocuous fires into a huge inferno that burned out over 1.2 million acres of land. Local records did not survive the blaze, making an exact casualty count difficult, but the victims are remembered with the Festigo Fire Museum and a memorial. When the flames eventually died out, the fire had consumed 1,807 five square miles, obliterated 12 communities, and caused the deaths of between 1,500 and 2,500 people. Number 4. London 1212 Also known as the Great Fire of GR Southwark, started south of the Thames in Southwark sometime between the 10th and the 12th of July 1212. The earliest account of this blaze appears in the Book of Accident Laws also known as the Libère de Antiqui Ligibu, composed in 1274. This states in this year was the Great Fire of South Park, and it burned the Church of St. Mary, as also the bridge with the chapel there. However, the greatest loss of life occurred on London Bridge itself. People fleeing from the fire in Southwark converged with people coming from the northern side of the river to help. But everyone on the bridge was now trapped as the fire had spread to both sides of the river. King John had approved the construction of wooden shops and houses on the bridge, and soon these were also alight. The number of people killed on the London Bridge alone at 3,000, and this figure also appears in the Guinness Book of World Records. Number 3. Cloquet Fire, Minnesota, USA, 1918 A particularly dry summer and early fall, coupled with sparks from a passing train near Surgen Lake, led to the catastrophic Cloquet Fire. The fire began on the 12th of October 1918, then whipped up by high winds. It spread eastward, swallowing some 38 towns and villages, destroying 4,000 homes and killing more than 450 people. It remains the worst natural disaster in the state of Minnesota. Number 2. The Black Dragon Fire, 1987 the Daxing Angling Fire, which blazed through forests in northeastern China, comes as one of the top of the Guinness World Records list of the planet's largest forest fire. It ravaged the area from 6th of May, more than 211 people were killed, and the fire scourged more than 2.5 million acres. It also spread into the Soviet Union. The burning lasted almost a month. When it was finally stopped on June 2, 1987, it's uncertain whether the fire was started naturally or by human error. It was one of the largest wildfires ever to occur, and the largest to strike China in over 300 years. Number 1. The Wisp Fire The Chinchaga Fire, or the Chinchaga River Fire, as it's also known, remains in joint first place as the world's largest forest fire in the Guinness Book of World Records. It was thought to have been started by human activity, most likely slash burning, and some 3 million acres of boreal forest across the provinces of British Columbia and Alberta were burned during the fire. The blaze lasted from early June right up to the 31st of October. It is the single largest recorded fire in North American history. The fire was allowed to burn freely, a result of local forest management policy and the lack of settlements in the region. The Chichanga fire produced large amounts of smoke, creating the 1950 Great Smoke Pall, observed across eastern North America and Europe. The smoke was mostly in the upper atmosphere and could not be smelled. There was much speculation about the atmospheric haze and its provenance. The Chichanga firestorm's historic smoke pall caused observations of blue suns and moons in the United States and Europe.